Hello everybody and welcome back to Fade Extra. I'm Kirukan and thank you for joining me. And we're on the end of this week. In the game. I guess it's the start of the week in real life. Whatever. Shut up. I just didn't go back to the game before I embarrass myself further. I hope you're prepared for this elimination battle because I'm looking forward to your fight. A fight between friends is a rare bird here. Not often do combatants understand one another so well. I plan to watch your fight with great relish. Now, I'll be waiting on the first floor. I don't think that was the normal Kotomine voice, but I don't remember what the old voice was. The priest leaves the room after uttering those macabre words. And it goes without saying that I'll be guarding my life against someone who has guided and helped me someone clueless like me. Okay. Final preparation time. I'll go to the commissary first and sort through the information in my room. Uh, try to decide what abilities to bring with me. Uh, that's not the right thing. Do I want to risk not having hack? I... Th Wait, that's not a hack skill, is it? I don't remember. Don't mind me, I'm, I'm rambling and wasting time. Sorry. What you got to say, Archer? We already know what they're going to do! I should piece together all the information I know before the elimination battle. This round, the bulletin board was tampered with to show my name, but not my opponent's. After an escape from the Unknown Master, I found residue of their magic and the mark their attack left on the school building. Right. And the source of that magic was... Blind Rage! Right. Upon investigating the damage done to the wall the next day, Reen guessed the servant had unleashed its blind rage. After that, I finally encountered my opponent on the second floor. They wore the guise of an effigy, but inside was a strong warrior. The enemy's servant class was... Berserker. Right. The servant's attack pattern screamed Berserker. Additionally, from the power of the servant's attacks, I felt they had to be a famous legendary soul. In order to repel the effigy, Reen came. Uh, Reen used a uniquely calibrated firewall bypass she had prepared earlier. She didn't come across one! I don't know what I'm talking about! From its effects, it seemed Reen knew the true name of the servant and the identity of the master. She called the noble phantasm. The Five Kitties of Cuddly Squee! No, I'm not picking that. I want to win this next fight! That, the, some of the responses in this game do make me laugh, though. But it's the Five Warriors of Guan Yu, which I believe is actually a mistranslation. Right, the noble phantasm I'll be facing is called Godforce, the Five Warriors of Guan Yu. And is guided by a halberd named Sky Piercer that can decapitate, pierce, strike, wallop, and sweep. <laughs> Hope you can't hear me chugging that. I know I say that like once per video, but I really hope you can't. Said Blade comes from the Romance of the Three Kingdoms and belongs to Lu Bu Fei Jian. I, I, I don't know if I said that uh, correctly. I had actually seen him once before, fighting as a servant in the battle between two of my friends. His master is Ronnie the Eighth. That girl, who saved me from danger time and time again, is now my opponent. But I... I will fight fiercely. The Colosseum doors beckon now. Okay, that's done with. So, we'll go and power Archer up one more time. And enter the boss fight. Uh, 
I have to say, this is probably one of the harder fights in the game. Not quite as hard as Dracula. I was wrong about my super strategy. Well, actually, it might still work, I don't know. But well, we'll figure something out. Yeah, I know. I'm great. Okay. That's taken care of. Now to go get my butt whipped. Man, my nose is giving me trouble. Of course. You will now enter the Colosseum and confront the opposing master. Are you ready? Remember, the only way to leave the Colosseum is to win. If you are ready, I will open the gate. Let's go for it! The way to the Colosseum is now open, young master. I wish you the best of luck and hope that you will return. Remember, it's kill or be killed. What could possibly go wrong? Everything, everything could possibly go wrong. I should have said something like that, but I didn't, because I'm kind of a loser. Um. Oh, okay. There is. I was gonna say, isn't there supposed to be an elevator here? wish you the best of luck today. Um, did we need to talk about something before we reach the bottom? I have no questions of my own, but do you have any for me? What are you? Me? I am Ronnie the Eighth, but you already possess that information, right? Not your name. What are you? What am I? I am a homunculus. An artificial life form created by my professor. Unfortunately, the refining process was lost some time ago. Thaumaturgy did not yet hold sway. So I am not a homunculus created by natural means. However, Blah, I tripped over that word. However, that knowledge, along with other lost information, will be restored once I obtain the Grail. I'm gonna be nice. I was hoping we could be friends. Friends? Analyzing. Analysis terminated. No thank you. I have no need of friends right now. Yeah. So you like banging your head against a wall, Master? That girl will never respond like a human. That's because she isn't. Let her appearance fool you, and you'll suffer in battle. She's got as much humanity in her as a box of hair. Get that through your head before it's too late. That was a very nice archer. I mean, I could uh, mention a certain homunculus, and you wouldn't like that. The elevator's descent slows to a halt. The beautiful girl across from me flashes a beaming smile. It appears that it's time. Well then. It's been a pleasure meeting you. After giving a polite bow, she walks briskly toward the Colosseum, her long hair waving gently. The fierce giant trails after her, bellowing deeply. I step forward, but not without a bit of sadness for what I've just witnessed. The curtains have been raised on the sixth elimination battle. Alright. Here we go! I'm staggeringly unprepared for this. Clouds of sublimination spiral, and a long-tailed golden bird sings the arrival of dawn. 
When the moon rises in the southern sky, all impurities will be cleansed and the proper conclusion reached. <laughs> now, are you ready? <clears throat> that is one massive servant. This will be like fighting a living fortress, huh? It'll be extremely hard to break down those walls. But you've improved too. If all he's got is brute strength, then we stand a chance of winning. Yeah, moo to you too, buddy. You and your weird rabbit ears. Well, unless we get some great music while I get my butt kicked. Okay. Also, I do have, like, this strategy here. I don't know what they said there. I wish I was subtitled. Hmm. Huh. I actually don't have a clue what I need to do here. This, uh... This guy isn't very insightful. Huh. Sorry if it's taking me a moment to figure out what to do here. You know, I saw it for just a second what it might be, and then I lost it. I totally screwed this up, I think. Watch as I go down in the first fight. Holy shit, that worked! Ow. <laughs> Archer, are you dabbing? Stop tapping! Okay, so I see a lot of breaks there. Uh, anything that can give me an advantage here? I know this is practically cheating. Wait, wait. I lost my place. Okay. Um... I don't know! <laughs> I'm just gonna... guess here. right about that one. gonna be tough. Maybe. Whoa. 
was, that one. Okay. Let's try it. Oh, that was lucky. That was not, however. Okay, I had those mixed up. What? Wait, did I have to have it up to... Oops. Okay, I might have just botched this. Uh, I'm gonna... I'm gonna risk it. Uh-oh. Ah, that was a bad idea. That was a really bad idea. Oh, God! Oh, jeez, that didn't even heal me all the way. Holy shit. Okay, Archer, do the thing! if I'm going to be able to do this. Eh, I might have screwed this up. Well, at least I'll go down in style if I lose here. Okay, let's see how much damage I can do now. That was less than I was hoping for. I think I might be in trouble, guys. Oh boy, I think I botched it. Um, crap, 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 crap. Uh, okay, that one's not showing. That one's not right either. That can't be right. I'm looking through all of these hoping to find somewhere where I can strike him. Goes nothing. I didn't think this through. Oh, God. Oh, well, that probably killed me. Ow.
Ow. Ow. Okay, let's try this again. Hopefully without dying. Ow! Okay, let's look at the... this carefully. That can't be right! Let's, uh, let's try healing him first. I hope this works. be able to just barely pull this out of my ass. Okay, yeah, I think I can win this, just barely. that. Do I want to risk it? I'm a risk it. Okay, here goes nothing. Oh boy. Well, that was a waste of a full restore. Oh, shit. Well, that's gonna kill me for sure. It, this guy's lied to me. It's the, it says the third turn is when they use the, uh... Noble Phantasm. Ah, I was so close! Okay, let's try this again. He's not using his Noble Phantasm this round. this instead. Okay, better idea.
Shit, that's still... Doesn't matter. Actually, in that case... Okay, here we go. Let's hope my plan works this time, huh? Oh, I'm gonna cut out so much from this. I don't think you guys want to watch me fail the entire time. <coughs> that should've been a... fake Helix sword. Oh, well. Oh, wait, never mind. Oh! He's dead! I didn't even have to waste the item! Awesome! That was pure dumb luck! Fantastic! I love it when I win out of sheer stupid luck. An explosive roar rips through the silence of the Colosseum. The crazed warrior's death growl shakes the earth, and yet the massive frame gradually disintegrates into thin air. Yay! I win! I am the greatest! I don't completely suck. Just mostly. The next moment, tranquility dominates the Colosseum once again. <coughs> the demise of the servant who has been her companion this whole time does not phase Ronnie. She whispers something as she traces the back of her hand where her command seal used to be. That can only last so long. Her fingertip is already disintegrating. She mumbles quietly as she raises her head, a slight smile on her face. <laughs> it's over, isn't it? The vanishing girl's lips mouth, goodbye with hollow eyes and a sad little smile. Ronnie disappears. Not even a hint of her fragrance remains under this virtual sea. Now, well, not even a congratulations from Archer after that harrowing experience. Thanks, buddy! Seriously, that that's really a depressing scene in the context of the whole game. So, I think that's it for uh, this week of the game. And this week of... Episodes. Well, <coughs> anyway, I won't drag it out any further. Thank you guys so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you come back for the next one. <laughs> Bye.